On December 25, 2021, the largest and most powerful space telescope, the James Webb Space Telescope, was launched into space for $10 billion. A month later, it reached its goal in solar orbit at a distance of almost 1 million miles from Earth. The first batch of photographs collected by Webb was selected by NASA to demonstrate the capabilities of the telescope and the challenges of upcoming science missions. Webb, which observes objects primarily in the infrared spectrum, is about 100 times more sensitive than its predecessor, the Hubble Space Telescope. Since the first scientific images and data from the telescope became available to astronomers, they have reported a flurry of startling preliminary discoveries, including several contenders for what could be the most distant galaxy ever seen. What kinds of amazing discoveries based on the images of Webb await us? What is there beyond the unknown? That scientists are already inclined to doubt the validity of the Big Bang Theory. Webb's First Deep Field The first scientific photograph to be demonstrated from the James Webb Telescope was an image of the SMACS 0723 Massive Star Cluster. At first glance, this picture is unremarkable. However, it reveals the full potential of the Webb. In one image, the telescope showed a picture of the so-called deep field. This is a very long exposure image of a small area of space giving a glimpse deep into the early universe. Another gravitational lensing phenomenon that Webb showed was when a supermassive star cluster created such a distortion of space-time that, like seeing through a magnifying glass, brought galaxies far, far away from the depths of the young universe closer to us. It took the telescope just 12.5 hours to take the picture. If you increase the exposure to days and weeks, scientists say, Webb can look into the times when stars were just beginning to emerge in our universe. Star birth in the Carina Nebula This landscape is the edge of the giant gas bubble of the emission nebula NGC 3324 in the Carina constellation, which is undergoing intense star formation. The images show space mountains. This is how scientists call the edge of the gas and dust cloud, where new stars form in dense globules. The stellar wind from the massive stars located at the top of the images is responsible for the shape of the cloud itself. By studying these images, you can find dust disks around stars where planets can form. And also, to trace the life of young stars at the earliest stages of their existence, which can take from 50 to 100,000 years. By the standards of stars, this is an instant. The earliest and fastest phases of star formation are hard to capture, but Webb's exceptional sensitivity, spatial resolution, and imaging capabilities will help scientists chronicle these elusive events. Incredible Views of Jupiter In July 2022, the James Webb Telescope took pictures of the largest planet in the solar system. Images show auroras, giant storms, moons, and rings surrounding Jupiter in such detail that astronomers called it incredible. Auroras extend over the north and south poles in this image, created from multiple telescope images. These light shows in the sky above the planet are the results of interactions with particles flying away from the sun. The Great Red Spot is a famous storm so big that it can swallow the entire Earth. It appears white in the picture because it reflects a lot of sunlight. First Photographed Exoplanet Webb for the first time took a direct picture of a planet that is outside the solar system. It orbits the star HIP 65426 in the Centaurus constellation 385 light-years away. The telescope took four incredibly detailed images of an exoplanet that is 5 to 10 times the mass of Jupiter. According to scientists, it is only 10 to 20 million years old, compared to the Earth which is 4.5 billion years old. It is just a baby. It's safe to say that this direct image of an exoplanet is a historic moment for astronomy says Sasha Hinckley of the University of Exeter, UK. Now, with the help of Webb, it is possible to study distant planets in detail and obtain information about their composition, temperature, and mass. As for the temperature of the HIP 65426b planet, it is definitely impossible to live there. If you landed on this planet, you would be burned alive very quickly.
WASP-39 Water on Another Planet NASA used a near-infrared imaging device and a slitless spectrograph to take a deep dive into the atmospheric composition of the WASP-96b exoplanet. As conceived by the designers, JWST does not only take photographs. Only a large number of dots may be seen on the screen in the form of a graph, but for scientists, this is a significant amount of information. It focuses researchers' attention on what they call the transmission spectrum. To do this, the scientists compared starlight filter through the planet's atmosphere as it travels over the star with unfiltered starlight detected when the planet is close to the star. Each of the 141 data points presented in the graph created shows the amount of light in a certain wavelength blocked by the planet and absorbed by its atmosphere. The results of the observations were unexpected. Until recently, it was believed that WASP-96b has a cloudless atmosphere as indicated by the shape of the spectral profile of sodium determined from observations of ground-based telescopes. However, the James Webb data suggests that there are still clouds and haze in the atmosphere, as well as traces of water vapor. And since Webb was able to detect water on an exoplanet, we have a better chance of finding an Earth-like planet that could support life. Cartwheel Galaxy Astronomers believe that several hundred million years ago, this galaxy collided with another smaller one. The so-called near-head-on collision forever changed the then-spiral-shaped galaxy, giving it a new shape and cartwheel-like structure. Webb's powerful infrared vision created this detailed image of the cartwheel and two smaller companion galaxies against the backdrop of many other galaxies. This image provides new insight into how the Cartwheel Galaxy has changed over billions of years, scientists say. It's called a ring galaxy because it has two rings, a colorful outer ring and a brighter inner one, that expand from the center. Ring galaxies are less common than spiral-shaped ones like our own Milky Way. The outer ring, expanding over about 440 million years, broke out and crashed into the surrounding gas, which caused active star formation. The inner core is made up of hot dust and young giant star clusters. The Most Distant Galaxy Just a week after its first images were shown to the world, the James Webb Space Telescope may have discovered a galaxy that existed 13.5 billion years ago. The galaxy known as Glass Z13 dates back 300 million years after the Big Bang about 100 million years earlier than anything previously identified, scientist Rohan Naidu of the Harvard-Smithsonian Center for Astrophysics noted. We are potentially looking at the most distant starlight anyone has ever seen, he said. When changed from infrared to visible spectrum, the galaxy appears as a red spot with white in the center, as part of a wider image of deep space called the deep field. Naidu and his colleagues, a team of 25 astronomers from all around the world, presented their findings about Glass Z13 in a scientific journal, shocking their fellow scientists. The team discovered the amazing properties of the Glass Z13 galaxy. For instance, it has a mass of a billion suns, which the scientists write is potentially very surprising, and this is something we don't really understand, considering how soon after the Big Bang it formed. With James Webb's resolution, we are able to see that galaxies have disks much earlier than we thought, says Allison Kirkpatrick, an astronomer at the University of Kansas at Lawrence. This is a problem, she says, as it contradicts earlier theories of galaxy evolution. There are no doubts so far about the Big Bang theory, but already a subtle hint that galactic evolution may turn out to be more complex than scientists thought. And the James Webb Space Telescope, the world's first observatory of space research, continues to pose riddles to humanity on a cosmic scale. For years to come, it will uncover the mysteries of our solar system, peer beyond distant worlds around other stars, and explore the mysterious structures and origins of the universe and our place in it. Astronomers are aware that they still have many incredible discoveries and reasonable doubts ahead of them because Webb is only beginning its anticipated 20 plus years of operation. <laughs>